Anything I can do to help out? Oh, sure. An extra set of hands will be useful. You remember when we patched in the receiver module, right? Well, I'm about to try something similar using the comm hub's transmitter and a frequency amplifier. If those parts still work, we'll have real-time two-way communication between the hub and any ASAM sensor. Sounds good. All right. I patched in the parts we need, but I think we're going to need more power for this. So I'm going to head down to Plutonium Well, boost its output a little. Whilst I'm doing that, it'd be really helpful if you could try tuning in the hub for me. Sure, I can do that. Great. Just sit yourself down at the vault hub. Keep turning the frequency knob until you get a clear signal. Then just sit back and wait for my return. Okay, won't be long. frequency you're disrupting gunner communications do you know what kind of trouble that can get you in you better tell me how you're doing this and fast sorry didn't mean to interrupt too late for apologies civilian gear ain't able to broadcast on this frequency what kind of hardware are you using where are you broadcasting from I'm not telling you that. Either you tell us now, or we'll just track you down. Don't make this harder than it has to be. I gotta go. Given the strength of your signal, you can't be far. Once we're done with our op, shouldn't take too long to find you. Don't. Go. Anywhere. If you'll excuse me. Darling! I got back as fast as I could. You listened to the radio? Yeah. I overheard the whole thing on my pip boy. The hub's broadcast frequency. It must be similar to the one the gunners use. Or at least close enough to cause disruptions. Oh, this is not good. We really don't want the gunners' attention on us. And we definitely don't want them sniffing around the comm hub. This is... Not good. Whatever it is, we can handle it. The gunners are a mercenary group. Guns for hire. <laughs> Never thought about it before, but I guess that explains their name. Anyway, they ain't exactly the nicest bunch of people you'd run across. If they can find a reason to mess with you, they'll do it. By broadcasting on their comm frequency, we've probably piqued their curiosity. They'll want to know what kind of tech we're using. They may even try and take it. I don't think we can afford to let the gunners come here. What do we do now? I don't know. Maybe I could talk to him. Convince him to leave us alone. Hold on. I think I could find where they're radioing from. All right. Looks like they were somewhere northeast of Olivia. Well, guess I should go check it out. Try find these gunners and see if I could reason with them. Although, kind of nervous. I'm used to dealing with raiders and your typical wasteland critters. But gunners, they're different. They're organized. Don't worry. I've got your back. You'll help? Oh, thanks. I feel better already. Here, let me update your map. There. The gunners were somewhere near one of those markers. But I don't know which one for sure. We'll have to check each of them. All right. Lead on and I'll follow. Let's see if we can talk these gunners into leaving us alone. So yeah, um, as you can probably tell, uh, I've actually just... Well, I, well, I'm quite glad it was able to do it. So if you remember the end of... Well, halfway through the last episode, we were having issues putting down plots. Well, it wasn't that that there was the issue. It was... Um, once I put them down... It would take like ten, fifteen minutes for you know the game to recognise what was happening. 
and then it would take another 15 minutes for it to happen and it was just taking forever and it basically took me two hours that's right two hours to do something that took me five minutes the first time i done it uh, and basically what actually happened is once i put down the final plot the, the storyline never actually changed like i sat there for like a whole hour and nothing happened so Basically what I'd done is I had to redo the entire Vault 81 sequence, which was an absolute pain in the arse. <laughs> and when you get back to Concord to speak to Jake, you can either do the plots with him, or you can skip it. As you can tell, I skipped it. So we, have, we actually haven't been back to Sanctuary to put down the new like, commercial... Um, the, Marshall things, you know, I've not put down the new plot yet, so we'll need to go back at some point. I'll do that off camera, probably after this this part of the mission, um, and then from on, basically we can just carry on with the, the storyline. So yeah, that's basically what's happened. So enjoy, basically. <laughs> That's what you want. I don't think this is the right place. Let's keep looking. God, I know this place. I gave him ASAMs. What the hell happened here? That's close enough. Who are you? Whoa, easy there. Easy. We're not looking for trouble. Why don't you just put that gun down and we could talk? Why are you here? We're just looking for some gunners. That's all. Gunners? You with the gunners? Whoa, now, I said we're not looking for trouble. Garland, a little help here? Look. All I need is for you to put down the gun. Then we can talk this through. Mine goes down when his goes down. Okay, that's fair. See? Putting it away. All right. Assuming you're not gunners, why were you looking for them? We were hoping to discuss something with them. Huh. Well, I doubt you'll get much of a response, but if you want to strike up a conversation, go ahead. I believe that one was the leader. Hey, I'm on your side. I just need you to tell me the truth. And maybe I can help. Yeah, I'd like to know that myself. If you don't mind us asking, 
What went down here? And who are you? Gunner expansion. They tried to seize this place. Locals resisted. Maybe even fought back. You can see the results for yourself. By the time I arrived, it was too late to help anyone. So I found a concealed position on the overpass and administered a little wasteland retribution. There's a lot to be said for ambushing enemies from the shadows. Sounds like you've some experience in that field. You still haven't told us who you are, or what you're doing here. I'm Aiden, and without sounding too melodramatic, I hunt down gunners. Been on this squad's trail for a week. This is the fourth settlement they've hit. Go on. Gunners have been unusually active lately, laying claim to territory all over the Commonwealth. This settlement was just the latest conquest. Saying that, this place used to just be a solitary hut. I've no idea how they built up so damn fast. Sudden growth must have been what made them a target. Sudden growth? Oh, no. Don't tell me the gun has attacked this place because I gave him ASAMs. What? The hell are you talking about? They're these little sensor things. Help people build stuff. I've been providing them the settlements for months now. Huh. Then this attack was your fault. Hey! Now you just wait a minute. You better watch what you say, mister. Calm down, both of you. Whether it was intentional or not, you made them a target. You can't blame me for what the gunners did. Folks deserve the opportunity to make a better life for themselves. And I don't appreciate some jumped-up vigilante accusing me of... Whoa, whoa, wait! You don't need to... Reinforcements. Hope you can fight.
Yourselves well. Yeah, well, felt the need to blow off a little steam after someone accused me of causing what happened here. Not gonna let that go, are you? Say what you like about them, but the gunners run a tight operation. Sooner or later, they'll figure out what happened here. Chances are you and your partner will be flagged as persons of interest. Oh, great. That's precisely the kind of thing we came here to avoid. You can expect more gunner attention from now on, so watch your backs. They'll give you even more trouble than they give me. Is there a way I can communicate with them? You could try, but I wouldn't advise it. At this point, you put too many of them down. They're not going to be interested in hearing your side of the story. Best thing would be to just lay low. So what are you going to do now? I'm leaving, and so should you. There's no guarantee more reinforcements aren't en route. Yeah, well... Nice meeting you. Yeah, whatever. Oh, and cut the charity with those sensors. They're just chum in the water. Excuse me. You think he's really gone? You're upset about something, I can tell. You heard what that guy said? That this was all my fault? You... Don't think he was right, do you? That given these people, A. Sam's made them a target? That I'm responsible for bringing the gunners here? Just keep a cool head, okay? Don't think about it too much. <sighs> I'm trying, but what that guy said really got to me. I'm just glad that Aiden fellow's gone. There's something about that guy that rubbed me the wrong way. Maybe it was the gun that he pointed at my head. And I'm not sure I trust his version of events regarding what went down here. Why don't you believe his story? I'm not sure. Just something about it didn't sit right. Let's get out of here. Hey, um, I know this may seem odd, but I think I want to stay here for a while. We may have stopped these gunners coming to Concord, but in doing so, we might have dug ourselves into an even deeper pit. I need to think things over. Maybe come up with a new plan of action for us. Or at the very least, reevaluate how we're doing things now. Whatever you decide to do, I've got your back. I won't be here long. Come find me at the hardware store later. And stay safe out there, alright? If anything happened to you, well, just stay safe. What we may actually do, because I didn't actually record it, is I'm going to actually go over to Sanctuary and I'm actually going to put up the plots the way I had them set up yesterday uh, before I had to, you know, uh, <laughs> start the save all over again. So you'll actually see, quite, I actually quite enjoyed the way I laid it out, actually, it was quite nice. So you'll, we'll have a, you'll have a look, you'll see. So I need to get it back to where it was because obviously the now it's only got well, agriculture, industry and commercial, eh, residential. Uh, so we'll head back over and we shall get uh, some of these things up. Oh, I forgot I need to do the bloody side quests as well. I'll do them later. Are you the one building these settlements? I heard you keep your people safe. So I'll talk to these guys then. Ah oh, shit, they found me. Keep oh, your heads down. Go. Have it your way. Hold on. Whoa, you win. Get out of here, bitch. So I'll do these sea quests later. It's just. Cause I done I done them yesterday because I thought maybe I'd just give the game some time to load, but it didn't. So <laughs> yeah, uh, he's he's hiding in there. I'll talk to <coughs> you as well. Raven, Raven Corvus, I need you to help me retrieve my drunk of a brother. All right, I'll do it. Good. 
I can put where he is in that wrist computer of yours. Now there's just one thing left. Just send me where you need me to go, and once you find him, send Crow to meet me. Hey there. What is it with these assholes? That's not the first impression I care to make. Thanks for throwing in with me. Look, I'll keep moving. I'm not going to drag this kind of trouble into your settlement. But if you aren't scared of whoever these shitheads are, I could dip into my rad rainy day fund, if you're willing to stop them. Whatever it is, I'll stop it. All right. Then let me see what you found on that hunter. A lucky item? That's what this shit is about? Tell me the problem, and I'll see what I can do. I used to go on about a bottle cap that kept me safe on the road, but it was just a story. I only have it because I like the design on the back. Yeah, take the damn thing if it'll get these idiots off my tail. So yeah, as I was saying, um, we'll do the plots now. Because, well, we need to wait for Jake to come back to Concord anyway, which will take a few days. This will take us about 10 minutes to do this. Um, so I'll try and, re I think I remember the way I set up uh, the other day. So, yeah. Let's go residential. It's to be this one. Flip it around, obviously. Yeah. It just gives me an idea of where it's to go. So this is all residential, this bit. I'll flip it back round. So yeah, we'll just get all these plots down and then we'll go and see Jake.
the crowd goes around here, all of the men look as pretty as a ghoul's ass. So just drink until you have a ghoul's ass.